Hello everyone and welcome to The Social Talks, an independent public digital news platform that generates news stories and editorials on pertinent issues that affect the contemporary youth. I'm Summer Lee and I'll be reporting an important issue that happened last week. A man was arrested in central Paris on December 23rd, 2022. William M., a 69-year-old man, shot seven to eight bullets near a Kurdish cultural center and a Kurdish hair salon. What was his motive? Well, it's pretty simple. This man, with his deep-seated racism and anti-immigrant beliefs, shot three Kurdish people dead and three injured. When the suspect was questioned the motive for his actions, he described himself as depressed with suicidal tendencies and said that he has always wanted to murder migrants and foreigners since a burglary at his home in 2016. With this motive, the man traveled first to St. Denis and eventually head to Ruhutangen in the 10th arrondissement of Paris, his final destination being the Kurdish Cultural Center. This has shocked not only France, but the Kurdish community as well, as they were left furious, leading to angry protests with hundreds of people brandishing photos of the three victims and calling for accountability. As their actions became extreme, such as setting a trash can on fire, the police fired tear gas, leaving 35 people injured. Protester Azat Suleiman, 55, told Agents France Press that he felt Kurds were being targeted in the diaspora and at home. This is a war against our people, targeting us in the four parts of Kurdistan and even in Europe, he said, adding he had high hopes that the French authorities would bring the perpetrator to justice. Even in the 21st century, racism is still a huge problem and hate crimes are constantly happening all over the world. Thank you for watching. For more news, please make sure to check out our website on thesocialtalks.com. I'm Summer Lee, and I'll be back with more news next time.